Hi everyone! I am going to talk to you about my case study for this term. Uh, my topic is preterm triplets um, and the mother in this case is a 38 year old multi-pair woman. Uh, she has one prior child who uh, was a singleton, born full term, no complications. Uh, she successfully breastfed her for two years um, and really enjoyed that experience, so wants to breastfeed these triplets as well. Um, these triplets were a product of in vitro fertilization. She delivered them early by cesarean section um, at 28 weeks and five days. And she was given steroids prior to the delivery to kind of help with the fetal lung maturity. Um, the triplets were born weighing 2 pounds 15 ounces, 2 pounds 13 ounces, and 2 pounds 5 ounces. Um, and right after delivery, they were all admitted directly to the NICU. Um, that's all I'm going to leave you with. Basically, her goal is to get these triplets as much breast milk as possible. Um, and there's a lot of breastfeeding work to be done here. Um, so I'm just going to leave you with that information for now. Um, but if you have any other questions about this case, let me know. I'd be happy to answer them. Um, I do have a link to a feeding guideline, a NICU feeding guideline from the University of Iowa that I really liked. Um, I found it helpful because it didn't go too much into the nitty gritty of things while still kind of covering all of the bases. Um, if you get on that link, look over on the left side and kind of keep clicking through the links to get all the information there from that guideline. Um, I also posted three articles. Um, I had a hard time finding any current, well, not any current, but good current research on multiples in breastfeeding. Um, the lack of breastfeeding research really seemed apparent in this topic. Um, so I have some older articles posted. Um, one I really, really liked was breastfeeding rights of multiple families, uh, which kind of goes over some of the guidelines and care that these families should automatically receive. I feel like it's a really valuable article even though it is still a little bit older. Um, another article I posted um, was direct breastfeeding in the NICU and breastfeeding duration for premature infants, which is based on singletons. Um, I also should note that the guideline uh, from the University of Iowa is also based on singletons. I couldn't really find any specific guidelines related to multiples, um, and I think that just kind of has to do with, you know, supply and demand. If you just keep demanding, maybe your supply will get up to the, the threshold it needs to. Um, so a lot of that information is based on singletons, but I think it's still very pertinent. Um, and then I also have a really great booklet that I love. Um, it's called Feeding Twins, Triplets, and More, um, which is for parents of multiples. Um, and I just felt like it really went over everything from different positioning to have to, you know, breastfeeding two at a time, um, to, you know, tips on going back to work. And then even at the end of the booklet, it has more resources for parents. So I found it really, really helpful in kind of covering all the bases that I could think of that these multiple families really would need. Anyway, uh, let me know if you have further questions for me. I'll be happy to answer them. Um, I look forward to seeing what you all think. All right, bye.